Greetings folks, hope you're doing well. This video is about downloading images. Have you ever tried to download Hyperion images? In this video, we're going to show you how to download the Hyperion images for free. Let's get started without further ado. As you can see, here's an overview of the Hyperion datasets that explain the differences between Hyperion datasets and compare them in the tables. And from the science tab, you can read about the satellite, its mission, and its products. We've attached these pages links in the description for easy and direct access. In the end, from Web Tools tab, we click on the Earth Explorer to enter the USGS website. If you don't want to visit these pages, you can directly go to the USGS website. However, we've attached the USGS website link in the description. Although Hyperion images are not commercial and not free, there are a number of these images as samples. The USGS has provided these sample images. Another website that you can access these images is NASA. Okay, in the open page, we click on the Visit Earth Explorer. As you can see, it redirected us to the USGS data center. Firstly, we have to log into our account. If you haven't set up an account for this website yet, you can select the Create New Account option. We enter the username and password and click on Sign In. On the left side, click on the Datasets tab to see all available datasets in USGS. Among the list, select the EO1 option and choose the last option which is EO1 Hyperion. Clicking on the Toggle Coverage Map option next to the Info icon will display the range of all available images that can be downloaded for free. Here you can see all the areas that have high print images for free. We'll randomly draw a polygon on an area. And by clicking on the result option, it will show us all the images of this range. Here you can compare images and choose the best possible image. You can also compare and choose the right image for each region. Here is one of the images well displayed for us. We click on the meta file to check the image information. One of the most important issues is the cloud cover percentage of the image. In this image, the percentage of cloud cover is zero. So, this image is suitable for downloading and doing the desired processing. We click on the download option. In the open window, we download the third option which is L1T product JOT format. The desired image is being downloaded. After the download, we unzip the image. Inside the image folder, all bands are available. One of the important files in this folder is MetaFile. In this file, there are descriptions of the image and all the bands. We copy the image folder pass and go to the Envy software. Then enter the copied path. Here, we choose the images meta file to ensure that all bands are imported into the software.
The image has been successfully imported into the software and is clearly visible. In the upcoming videos, we will carry out the necessary processing on this image.